as you saw my grill before um, on this rabbit um, people don't like when I say that that's all right we've got the old grill section was broken and the new one isn't so anyway I've got I'll show you what we did to fix this and so um, if you've noticed that this style grill is really hard to find um, with the square I Westy rabbit which is the one assembled in Westphalia or West Westmoreland Pennsylvania Westmoreland fence Pennsylvania so if it was assembled there usually it had the square eyes if it was assembled in Germany it has the round eyes so Here's what I ended up with is a lot of these are available at Pick Apart. So um, we found these available. And I had this is the center section of the old grill where I hit a dog right after I got brand new grill was in the car. And I looked for other brand new grills. Couldn't find them uh, for this year car. So I had this one. I had one of these round eyes playing around and I was like well maybe we could graft them together and make a grill so that's exactly what we did and I'm going to show you it's cool this part right here actually fits if you cut off if you see right here it actually fits inside the other grill this is the old grill right around here this is the old grill this is the round eye grill fits right inside of it so if you cut very carefully along here with a nice cutoff wheel a good cutoff wheel cut out here cut around here and you cut around here all the way around you can graft this part of the round eye grill which are available all over the place usually you can even buy them new and cut this straight right here so that it matches here and here and then inset it from the other side so you can see a lot of ugly looking stuff here can't see it when it's on the car um, what we used was was uh, I'm trying to think of the kind of epoxy um, I have this kind of glue it's a uh, a really high grade of I'm trying to think what it's called uh, it's that well it's a super glue made by adhesive technologies I believe I'm looking for the bottle I don't know where it's at right now but we put it in place with that and then after it was in place then we used this super silicone I get from O'Reilly Auto Parts, which is actually stronger again if you haven't, this is one of my first videos you've watched. This is actually, oh man, 10 times stronger than Ultra Black from Permatex. So this is called Mega Black by Versachem. People say, oh, well, that's the production company. I don't know. It doesn't matter. It's way better and stronger, whatever you want to think. But... I use that to hold it in place and this thing will never go anywhere it'll be on here forever and ever and it will never come off so then we painted it black again and then I'm gonna actually probably put I might put a GTI red on here I'm not sure yet because it has a silver edge around here I might put red well, I might leave it black I don't know but anyway that's how you repair the grill if you've just got a crack and also if you've got cracks in this part of your grill you can use old pieces of your grill and you can use them to patch the area and you use J&B Weld, J&B Quick um, to graft them together it works really well real strong uh, that's the best thing to use on those grills you can actually sand it and it'll adhere if you sand it before you put it on It'll adhere really well to the grill. You can sand it and let use it like Bondo. 
Plus, um, you can use that uh, Pour 15 epoxy putty as well. But that's not as strong as the JB Quick. So anyway, that's just a way to how to repair your rabbit grill. So that's the Westy, they call it, rabbit grill repair. Talk to you in the next video. Please like, share, and subscribe.